beautiful people and welcome back to my channel or welcome to your first time in my corner of the internet. My name is Timpani. I'm a Phoenix based content creator. I focus on beauty, travel and style content. And today I thought I would just give you guys a little like life update slash like what's going on slash like what's coming to the channel type situation. I promise you guys I don't plan on taking these like long breaks from YouTube. Um, it just happens that way. Like this is the first video I'm actually like sitting down and recording in months. Like I couldn't tell you the last time I actually sat down and filmed a video. And I just get out of my rhythm of like, you know, sitting down and filming and editing and uploading and I just like get out of that rhythm and it takes me so long to just get back on the train for some reason. So yeah, but there's also been like a lot going on in life. Um, so the last videos you would have seen here on the channel is my Costa Rica vlogs. If you haven't checked those out, I'll leave them linked in a card as well as down in the description box. Um, but yeah, so I went to Costa Rica end of November, like around Thanksgiving time, um, came back. Oops, sorry. So yeah, I went to Costa Rica at the end of November, like around Thanksgiving time, um, came back, immediately had to start looking for an apartment because we had to move. Um, so I had to look for a new apartment and start packing the old apartment. And then January, I went to Finland, like beginning of January. And I don't know, just having a trip at the beginning of the year kind of like threw me <laughs> like, whoo, for when. But also that trip just was like, <sighs> Not the greatest. So I had originally filmed like a pack with me slash like empty apartment tour. And then I also did like a pack with me for Finland. And I was planning on uploading like Finland vlogs. Um, that trip to Finland, however, just didn't go as expected. Um, I went with people that I've never traveled with before. And I've done that before. Like I had a coworker back in college. Um, I had mentioned like a festival to her and she was like, let's go. So we did. We went to um, Oceaga in Montreal for like a week together. Like we said like two words to each other like at work. Um, but then when I took this trip and it was like totally fine. But for some reason, <laughs> this trip was just no bueno. And it's just funny because my sister and my mom kept trying to warn me like, oh, you shouldn't go on this trip. I don't think you should go to this trip. And I was like, no, nah, it'll be fine. It'll be great. And it was not. So I guess, you know, listen, <laughs> it's a lesson, a lesson in just like learning um, to other people's opinions. Um, so yeah, I just decided that I wasn't going to, I don't know, I feel like I just didn't want to put the energy into editing those vlogs. Um, and I'm no longer friends with those people. So I just felt like it's probably best to just keep their presence off of my channel. Um, so no Finland vlogs. But anyways, that brings us to January. So January, we moved. Finland. February was pretty, you know, I don't know. Nothing really happened in February. And then March was my niece's uh, first birthday. My sister from Georgia came out. She flew out for that. Um, and she was here for about a week. Um, so yeah, that pretty much brings us current to like everything that's been going on in life and kind of just like being pulled in all these directions, going through a lot of stuff. And I don't know, there's like getting mentally ready to like show back up here on the channel. So that is where I've been the last few months. So yeah, so that's as much like that's what's been going on with like life. Um, as far as content goes, um, I've really just been working like a lot on like background stuff, like creating systems and workflows for me to be able to like stay on top of content, but also stay like consistent with it and like brainstorming ideas and taking like classes and like watching all the YouTube videos and like SEO and all this other kind of stuff. Just trying to like put my best foot forward with content going forward. Um, so yeah, I've been working on my blog a lot. Um, if you didn't know, I do have a blog. It's uh, www.likethedrum.com. Um, on there, I kind of just share, you know, my travels and some beauty and some style content. Um, but if you're ever interested in seeing like more in depth itineraries to some of the travel vlogs I post, like um, the Greece vlogs, the Paris vlogs, um, the Costa Rica vlogs, like I mentioned, I've done like a bunch of posts on all of those places. Um, so yeah, I'll leave the link for the blog down in the description box in case you want to check it out. Um, but yeah, I've just really been working on that because I've, it's been on the back burner for so long. Like I've been like kind of going with new content, you know, folks on Instagram and YouTube. And then my blog has just kind of just been like in the background, but I'm really focused on trying to build my blog simply because it's best to have something that you own. Like a lot of like content creator type accounts will tell you like, 
you should have a platform that you own. So instead of relying on Instagram, instead of relying on YouTube, instead of relying on like TikTok or whatever, um, a blog is just a good way to do that because you know, if something would happen to any of those apps, like your website still exists and you can still have access to your audience. So really um, trying to just like amp up the content on there and then eventually I'll start working on like the newsletter and like all that stuff. But yeah, so that's kind of what I've been doing as far as blog stuff goes. And then I've also started over on Instagram. Um, my old account was just, I don't know, I just felt like there wasn't really a, an audience connection there. And that's mainly because I did, you know, you know, follow for follows back in the day and um, just like, I don't know, a lot of random, like people that I've gone to like high school with or college with. Hold on, there's a large truck passing. Okay, he's gone. <laughs> um, where was I? Oh, so yeah. So on my old Instagram, it was just a lot of like, I feel like, um, like fake bot accounts, um, accounts from like the follow for follow days. Um, people that I went to high school with that are not really interested in like blogger type stuff or stuff that I would want to share or whatever. Um, so yeah, I decided to start over on Instagram, start from zero and just really work on building an audience connection. So yeah, if you're interested in following me on Instagram, I will leave my Instagram link down below. It's just at like the drum. But yeah, so I started over on there. Love if you would give me a follow. I really just wanted to be able to build an engaged audience and just really connect with the people that choose to follow me. Um, as well as being able to post the content that I want to post. Like, I just feel like even though I try the whole like, who cares, just post what you want to post type situation on my old Instagram, um, I just I felt like a mental block as far as like being able to show up on stories and be like, hey guys, like, good morning. Like, you know, this is what I'm eating for breakfast. Like, you know, I don't know. I just feel like it's weird showing up as like a content creator to people that you know in real life. Like if you're a content creator, I feel like, you get what I'm saying. Like, you know what I'm talking about. But yeah, so I just wanted to more so recreate the Instagram so that, you know, people that want to see, um, you know, my like outfits of the days that are interested in reading like my travel content that are interested in like new YouTube videos, all that stuff. Um, the people that are interested in doing that can find me versus just kind of like pushing it out to people that don't care, you know? <laughs> um, so yeah, so that's that. Um, what else is new? I am planning on getting on TikTok. I'm not sure if I'll be on TikTok by the time this video goes up, um, but if it is, it'll be linked in the description box down below. But I know like TikTok's like the place to be. People are like, just go to TikTok, just do TikTok. But I just feel like I don't know how to show up on there yet. So that's something else that I've been like researching is trying to figure out how to show up on TikTok because like, I'm not like a dancer. Like I'm not gonna get up there and do dances. I just, that won't be me. <laughs> like, like, don't get me wrong. If you like dig deep on YouTube, you might be able to find like an old like high school dance video, but chances are you won't ever find that. But anyways, <laughs> um, so while like I do like enjoy dancing, like showing up and like, no, <laughs> no, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. I'll pass. Anyways, um, so yeah, that's kind of where we're at content wise. As far as YouTube goes, um, I will be uploading one video a week from like, the foreseeable future. Um, I was doing two videos a week, but I just feel like that was getting really daunting for me. Like I, I think that was like kind of the problem. I was like, I would have like a few good weeks of like, oh yeah, here's like two videos a week that I could upload. And then when I couldn't figure out like a second video to upload for like whatever, um, it just kind of like I didn't do it. And then like the schedule was off. It was weird. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I just feel like that was kind of like the struggle was trying to come up with like, I have like plenty of video ideas, but it's like kind of like filming like two different video concepts in one week, which is a lot. Sorry, there are lots of sirens. I live by a mountain um, with like a popular hiking trail and I'm assuming something happened on the trail because like a fire truck just went by, an ambulance just went by. So... Hopefully they're okay. Anyways, um, so yeah, as far as YouTube goes, I will be uploading one video a week until about July, um, simply because I need to get back into my rhythm of, like I said, just like filming and editing and all that jazz. And I feel like trying to commit to two videos a week at this moment in time is just a little too much. Um, so I've kind of worked on like a content creator, content creator, a content calendar as far as what videos are going up for like the next few months. Um, and I can commit to, you know, 
sitting down filming those getting those edited and getting those uploaded for you guys um speaking of which the next video that will be up is going to be my sephora spring sale haul um i got some goodies during that it's past now but i thought i would share the haul with you anyways um so yeah that's gonna be the next video up and then as far as like future content goes um got lots of exciting travels coming up i'm so excited to share all that with you guys um me and my friend natalie are headed to disneyland at the end of may so i'll be doing some vlogs for that um in july i'm going to hawaii with my sister and my niece for about a week so more vlogs there um there's a tentative new york trip i've never been to new york city and it's so funny because people are like how have you been to like all these places but you've never been to new york city and it's because most of my friends have already gone so they don't want to do like the like touristy bits again because it's expensive um so i just never had anyone to go with but my friend kate who you would have met in the los angeles vlogs um which i'll leave in a card um she messaged me and my friend brooke and was like hey like i think we should do like this like ultimate girls trip to nyc you know like do all the touristy spots do good restaurants stay in a cute hotel all that jazz um so yeah so that's tentative for like the end of september and then um me and brooke did get a great flight deal um to spain in november so i'll be spending this thanksgiving in spain and portugal um i think we're doing like four days in spain no that's not right we're doing one two, and then we're doing that maybe like six days in spain and then three days in portugal we're going to lisbon um so yeah lots of exciting travel content coming up and then of course some, you know some beauty hauls and some style hauls and some other type videos coming in there for you but yeah um i hope you guys have an incredible day if you haven't done so already make sure to subscribe i think by the time this video goes out we'll actually have hit a thousand subscribers um right now i'm like two away i think i'm at 998 so exciting times guys exciting times um but yeah i hope you guys have an incredible day if you haven't done so subscribe for more future content for me and i hope to see you in the next one bye